Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Totally Tanya Vlogs. So glad you decided to join me today. And today we are going to talk about growing your YouTube channel. Everybody on YouTube, you're trying to grow your channel, but there's so many videos, there's so much competition. How can you possibly stand out amongst all the other ones? And today we're going to talk about how to use YouTube Studio to gain information, to understand your channel, and how to grow it. So I've been on YouTube for two years, and I am currently at 2,630 subscribers. The way that I have done this so far is simply by keeping track of YouTube Studio, keeping track of my analytics, keeping track of what videos people like to watch, what they don't. My channel is reality TV. I do soap operas. I do reaction videos, reviews, family vlogs. I have so many different things and it's hard for me to zero in on one thing that will attract attention because it's really hard you guys my subscribers and people that watch my channel you guys are very hard to understand because I can make a video about one thing and it gets 500 views and I make a video similar to that one and it gets 100 views so it's like what is going on it's so hard to figure this out sometimes but we can figure it out we can grow if all these other people can have millions of subscribers hundreds of thousands of views on their videos then so can you so let's today talk about YouTube Studio and help you to understand that a little better. Okay, so if you're using an Android phone, there's a YouTube Studio app that you can download from Play Store. It's free. And it looks like this. And we go to the dashboard. Okay, so right now I'm being totally straight up with you guys. You can see all my information. And right on the front of it, if you were monetized, if you're not it will be a little different but if you're monetized this is what it will look like and it tells you your analytics for the last 28 days you're like what is analytics analytics is all the important numbers how many people are watching your videos are your subscribers watching are they not subscribed are they getting views how many views how many likes what are the comments all of these things are so important and we have to try to keep track of them and it's so much stuff it's like how can I possibly keep up with it well I have found this certain way that I can keep track now if you go to the Android app here analytics click on view more and I've actually got a congratulations in here your channel's views are up 58% mainly due to more people watching several of your videos from outside of YouTube which is awesome and my real-time views in the last 48 hours I have gotten 1100 views on my channel if you click on that click on the little real time 48 hours go to 60 minutes 29 views in the last uh, 60 minutes the last hour I've had 29 views on my channel so my top videos real time views big brother wedding I just posted that yesterday and it already has 203 views big brother is a big thing on my channel it seems like a lot of my subscribers are about Big Brother. They like reality TV. And so when I make Big Brother videos, they seem to get a lot more views. And then I did some stimulus videos. WMR bars disappeared. Unfortunately, that's only got 48 views in the last 48 hours, in the last two days. And then we have Bold and Beautiful, and again, Nicole Franzel. But see, there's something I'm talking about. We have Nicole Franzel's wedding. We have her rehearsal dinner, over a couple hundred views in the last 48 hours. But I also have a Nicole Franzel pregnancy diary video, and that's only had 39 views in the last 48 hours. So that is, it is confusing. It is like, why are people watching certain things and not the other? Then you have your views. I've had 17,000 views in the last 28 days. I've had 521.8 hours and if you click on these it gives you a nice little graph here that you can see my views are up my hours are up so it's really doing good lately it seems like my channel has really started to take off I'm really excited about that so I can keep track of this stuff by simply going through this every day I've gained 74 subscribers in the last 28 days that's something to be proud of you know then it has my top videos in the last 28 days my top videos with the most views 
Zach Rant speaks, speaks his truth. Uh, 1,012 views. WMR bar has disappeared. That one has actually had 853 views. Now, if you recall, I was just looking at the last 48 hours, it only had like 39 views. But altogether, in the last, I think, nine days, 853. Rachel Riley, 778. Bold and Beautiful, 761. And so if you'll see, there's a pattern here. We have Reality TV, Stimulus. Reality TV, Soap Opera. Reality TV, Reality TV, Reality TV. Reality TV, Soap Opera. Stimulus, Reality TV, Reality TV, Soap Opera. These are my top videos. So what I am seeing here is Reality TV, Soap Operas. Those are what my viewers want to watch. So those are what I need to make more of. And on YouTube, it doesn't really matter. You're like, well, I like making this type of video or I want to do this type of video. It only works if people are viewing it and you're bringing in the views, which is going to get you the watch time. It's just going to make you the money. If you were trying to do this to make a living or to earn a living, you have to follow what the audience wants. It's not so much what we want to do, but what are we going to be attracting people with? And I always look at it like a fishing, like you're going fishing. You're throwing out your pole. When you, when you upload that video, you are essentially putting out your pole in the water and waiting for the fish to start going for the bait. And then a review. It's like catching a fish. You caught another fish, caught another fish, caught another fish. And you really want to catch as many fish as possible. So heck with the pole, let's start grabbing nets, right? Let's grab nets. Let's pull them by the thousands, by the hundred thousands. That's what we ultimately, our goal is here. Because once we start making those kind of views, that's when you really start making good money. Because then people see more ads, your ads are getting played more. Now when you go to the next section, first we were at overview. Now we're going to reach. Impressions. I've had 94,000 impressions. And that means whenever my thumbnail of any of my videos comes up on somebody's screen. If it's on your screen, it's counted as an impression. And now my impression click through rate is 6.3 that number needs to be raised that needs to be higher because i want more people to click on my videos and this says as of march 8th data for impressions click through rate includes thumbnails shown on tv on game console devices some shifts and metrics may occur on this date so that's not just on the screen or like the laptop or the phone, even if it's on a TV or a game console now. So that's really cool. I did not see that before. And this tells me where my traffic's coming from. My top sources are Facebook, Reddit, Twitter, Google search, top YouTube search terms. When people will find me, they are searching Big Brother 23, BB 23, Big Brother 23 audition, Nicole Franzel, and some, obviously some are actually searching me, totally tiny vlogs. 0.9% of my views, people are searching me directly, which is awesome. The top video is suggesting your content. This is other videos that are including like the same kind of information that are in mine. Top playlist, playing your content. These are all different playlists I have. A lot of my playlists, people were viewing my playlist and that's so good. 35.9% viewed my Big Brother series. If you are a Big Brother fan, definitely go check out my Big Brother playlist. I have videos. It's a lot of the last few seasons. A lot of stuff. If you like just to reminisce and go back and check it out. I really like it. And then we got a lot of stimulus. We have COVID-19 pandemic videos. Celebrity gossip. Guided meditations. I even have affirmation videos. Positive things you can find on my channel. Now, engagement. Engagement is so, 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 so important. Last 28 days, 1 minute and 50 seconds. Previous period, 1 minute and 40 seconds. Now keep in mind, most of my videos are like 2 or 3 minutes. I make short videos and so I'm getting about half or a little over half maybe of engagement on my videos, which is pretty good. Top playlist. Again, Big Brother series, 37 Point zero top playlist hours I've made 37 hours of watch time in the last 28 days just from the Big Brother series 
So see, that's why it's so important to make playlists of your videos and to divide them up because people, sometimes people are lazy. They don't want to go look through the videos, but if you have a section, this is this type of video and this is this type, they're much more likely to click on that and then get you more views. Look, nine hours, nine hours, 25 hours, seven hours, all from playlists that add up to overall hours of the whole month which ends up being what you're going to make based on all this data together. Now, audience. Who is my audience? Who are you guys? Who is watching me? Female. 73% of you are female viewers and 26% are male. And the age group is pretty much averaging from 18 to 44 top geographies. I love this. This is so great. I love this. I'm always looking at this. United States. 75% of my viewers are from the United States. 6% however are from Canada. And we don't want to forget about the 3% from Australia. Hello Australia. We love you. We love you Canada. 0.8% Netherlands. Love you Netherlands. And 0.7% United Kingdom. United, Ki United Kingdom. You're awesome. Top languages. 97.7% are without subtitles. 2.2% need English subtitles. So I hope you guys can understand me clearly in the subtitles. And I know a lot of times it likes to mix up my words and say stuff I'm not saying. So now watch time from subscribers. Not subscribed. 59% of people watching my channel are not subscribed. Hello. What's going on with this? We gotta change this right away, guys. Come on, if you're watching my videos, please, please, please subscribe. Let's get this number up to 100%. I would love to help you guys grow. That's what I wanna do here. I wanna help you guys to understand analytics and maybe it'll give you some information that you didn't know yet. And maybe that will help you to advance to that next level on YouTube. And that's what I'm hoping for. So here we go. Estimated revenue, like I said before, last 28 days, $65.62. RPM is what YouTube ads will pay me personally for a thousand views on an app. So $3.85 per thousand views is what I'm making currently. Ad type, skippable video ads are 85% of my ads. Bumper ads, display ads, 6%, 4%. Non-skippable video ads, 3.2. Top earning videos for the last 28 days. Now this is interesting. These are what videos have made me the most money in the last 28 days. Now altogether is way different. This is only for the last 28 days. WMR bars disappeared. I've made $4 and 95 cents just from that one video. Stimulus payments now on the spin cards, $3.97. Bold and beautiful spoilers, $3.41. Funny gift reactions for Big Brother, $2.60. The numbers just go on and on because I have over 600 and something videos. So talk about making money in your sleep that's definitely what I'm doing and I love it I think it's amazing that I have the ability to do this and it has the potential to grow so much and it says top geographies by CPM United States a total of nine dollars and 88 cents in the last 28 days so that is the end of that as far as what information this will give you you can go to the comments you can go through here and you can respond to your comments and whatever you want to do with that. Then you have your playlist. I have so many playlists. Small YouTuber support. If you guys want to watch those videos, check those out and share them. If you're watching them, please share them. And this gives other people the opportunity to watch this video as well and to learn other ways to grow their channel. We have tarot card and magic spells. We have kid videos, DIY. YouTuber tips and tricks, tutorials, student debt, my kids' different videos all about Aaliyah, cooking with Tilly Tanya, face mask, paranormal videos, and we have workout videos, space, tattoos, YouTubers, my Christian ministry, songs I've wrote. 
we have all kinds of stuff in a playlist so definitely go check out the playlist you might just love them don't even forget about the reiki stuff guys law of attraction reiki spirit guides and angels lots of cool stuff like that to watch most of my videos though big brother they all go into big brother series celebrity gossip is another big one and i have one that's just for big brother 21 that one has 72 videos just from that season but such great videos guys and i love to look back on big brother i have a passion in my heart for big brother i tell you 371 music slideshows and we have so many different kinds they're so good i love all of them and i think you guys will enjoy them too if you just take the time go back look through them if you're not doing nothing check them out i bet you'll find something you'll enjoy all kinds of good stuff guys so definitely go check those out i'm sure there's something for everyone that's what i always say there's something for everyone on my channel also check out my channel membership where you can be a vip on my channel and get extra perks just for being a member so that is the conclusion of today's video all about youtube studio and analytics understanding it better and i hope this helped you if it did please give this video a like comment your thoughts comment T tell us something about yourself in the comments we love to hear from you so thank you so much and i will see you guys in the next video stay safe